Hi friends, IELTS, IELTS or International English Language Testing System is a world recognized testing system for English language proficiency for non-native English speakers around the world, maybe for higher education purposes or global migration purposes. IELTS is jointly managed by British Council, IDP or Cambridge English. Some of my friends wanted to get some more information about IELTS and that's why this clip is made. Around 4 million people in around 140 countries face this exam annually. Most of the people, maybe around 50% of the people don't get the required score at the first time itself. If you don't score the required level at the first time itself, you will lose at least $250 plus your valuable time. Just because you are fluent in English, you won't be able to get the required score at the first time itself. Therefore, you will have to practice, practice, practice and practice or else you can get the support of a competent teacher for this IELTS and do some mock tests. With that practice only you can get the required score at the IELTS. In IELTS there are two types of tests, academic and general training. In IELTS for listening and speaking both you will get the same exam for academics and general training both but reading and writing there will be different first please get to know about the test format and practice with mock tests in your mock test if you don't score more than the required level of the score please don't take the original test lest you will lose your money and time both in IELTS there are two types of tests academic and general academic is for higher education purposes while general is for migrating purposes up to nine bands you can score for some universities you are required about seven bands and some institutions ask for less like 4.5 English proficiency is tested in four aspects listening, reading, writing and speaking. For all aspects you will get up to nine and you will get an average up to nine of the band. You can book your IELTS online or you can take the test at a convenience center. You may face all four tests in a single day or sometimes you may have to face speaking tests separately within seven days of other tests. Okay, let's see how listening is tested. Academic and general both get the same exam. Do not register for IELTS exam if you haven't got the required score for practice tests. Please do not open the question booklet until you are told to do so. Read the instructions and be confident about what you have to do. Your prior practice will help your understanding and confidence. Keep in mind that all the records are played once only. You will have no second chance to listen, so listen very carefully. You will get 40 minutes for the whole test, listening test, 30 minutes for the test and at the end of the test you will get 10 minutes to transfer answers to the sheet. There will be four sections for the listening test. The format is going to be you will listen to four recordings of native English speakers and then Write your answers to a series of questions. 
first recording is going to be a conversation between two people set in an everyday social context second recording is going to be a monologue set in an everyday social context example a speech about local facilities third recording is going to be a conversation among up to four people set in an educational or training context example a university tutor and students discussing an assignment fourth recording is going to be a monologue on an academic subject example a university lecture duration for the listening test is going to be approximately 30 minutes and you are allowed an extra 10 minutes to transfer your answers from your question booklet to your answer sheet number of questions will be 40 There will be a variety of question types chosen from multiple choice, matching, plan, map or diagram labeling, form, note, tables, flow charts, summary completions, sentence completions like that. Each correct answer is used one mark. Scores out of 40 are converted to the IELTS 9 band scale. Scores are reported in whole and half bands. This is the sample answer sheet. Reading test is designed to assess a wide range of reading skills including how well you read for the general sense of a passage. read for the main ideas read for the details and understand the implied meanings recognize the writer's opinion attitudes and purpose follow the development of an uh, argument like that format for the academic reading will be three long text which range from the descriptive and factual to the discursive and al- analytical These are taken from books, journals, magazines, maybe or newspapers. They have been selected for a non-specialist audience, but are appropriate for people entering university courses or seeking professional registration. Duration for IELTS reading is going to be approximately 60 minutes. including the time it takes to transfer your answers from your question booklet to the answer sheet number of questions will be 40 task types will be filling gaps in the passage of written text or in a table match headings to written text to diagrams or charts complete sentences you short answers to open questions answer multiple multiple choice questions each correct answer will receive one mark scores out of 40 are converted to the ielts 9 band scale scores are reported in whole and half bands you will have to download the reading test answer sheet general training reading will be different format will be something like extracts from books magazines newspapers notices advertisements company handbooks and guidelines these are materials you are likely to encounter on a daily basis in an english speaking environment In general training also you get around uh, 60 minutes for the whole test that's including the time it takes to transfer your answers from your question booklet to your answer sheet number of questions will be 40 tasks will be fill in the gaps in a passage of written text or in a table match headings to written text 
to diagram or charts, complete sentences, give short answers to open questions, answer multiple choice questions, like that. Each correct answer will receive one mark. Scores out of 40 are converted to the IELTS 9 band scale. Scores are reported in whole and half bands like in other cases. In academic writing, you will have to write at least 150 words. The test taker must summarize, describe or explain a table, graph, chart or a diagram. You will have to write an essay of at least 250 words in academics. In general training, you will have to write a letter for at least 150 words. And then you will have to write a short essay of around 250 words you will get around 60 minutes for the whole test, like in reading. In speaking test, you will get a face-to-face -face interview without any disruptions or distractions. This includes short questions, speaking at length about a familiar topic and a structured discussion. You will get around 11 to 14 minutes for the speaking test. Okay friends, hope you will practice enough for the IELTS test or else you will get the support of a competent teacher for your test and wish you all the best for your IELTS test. Thanks.